The north shore of Oahu was hit hard by the storm yesterday. Huge surf washed onto the roads, leading to flooding on the highway and at Haleiwa Boat Harbor. Nikki Shenfeld checked out the aftermath today and has more. A completely different sight this morning after the storm. Sun, no wind, and much calmer ocean conditions. We were really amazed by the big surf and how it kind of spilled over all the way to the street um, because it wasn't there when we started out, so that was really amazing to see. You can see the sand across the road at many spots this morning. Waves reaching Kamehameha Highway from sunset to Haleiwa. And while it was a sight to see for thousands on the North Shore, some residents thought the city and state should have blocked the highway off to the public due to the poor conditions. In the past, they did close the road, close Cam Highway for residents only. And they were checking IDs and they were turning people around right at the signal. Why that wasn't done yesterday is beyond me. They had ample warning what was going to happen and they did nothing. I reached out to state transportation officials and was told the city and state agencies work diligently to keep roadways open and accessible for the public. And closing a major thoroughfare is a last resort. Over at Haleiwa Harbor, the ocean reached the parking lot, covering walkways and certain docks. Boaters say their grateful floating docks were put in a few years ago because the water level reached to here. There is just so much water coming past the break wall into the harbor, and it was just rolling through. It's just the most energy I've seen the ocean unleash. Freed tells us the boats were okay. A few had some broken lines, and others had minor damage to their sails. Nikki Schoenfeld, KH12 News.